<laughs> what's up guys welcome back or to the channel um, <laughs> wow this car is something else um, I just want to say I appreciate all of the awesome and kind words on the you know on the reveal video of this uh, there's a lot of you who are like oh my goodness I thought it was gonna be a truck but perfect perfect match perfect for the channel everything and I honestly appreciate that I, I, I it's like I kind of have an idea of the direction I want to take this car but um, you know there's lots lots of stuff planned obviously this can take us to a whole new realm of like even going to cars and coffee and with the truck we do a lot of truck meets so it like gives us both worlds and both ends of the spectrum which is awesome from the car side a lot of like nice cars there's a lot more detailing and stuff involved than trucks that are just rugged and you know trucks just get used so there's a, it's a whole new world which is awesome for for you guys awesome for me awesome for the channel so it, I, I'm so excited but today we have something arriving obviously if, obviously you probably already know by the title but yes, like I said, I got hit with information left and right and all on Friday. The huge pieces of information all at once. So it was just completely overwhelmed. And this car was one of them. And the lift kit for my truck should be delivered today as well, which is crazy. The huge 12 inch max altitude lift should be delivered today. Hopefully we'll catch this lift kit coming off the truck because from what I've seen, these boxes are ginormous enormous uh, for these lifts so oh and yes the car is still wrapped obviously you guys haven't seen I haven't got the chance to uh, I'll give it the full detail we're gonna have to get the paint protection film done window tint done we're gonna have to get the ceramic coating done there's so much to do with this uh, and it's only the first week already so let's get into this without further ado yes a few of you were asking chargers only come in automatic which is honestly okay for a beast like this people say they've driven the they've driven the chargers in or they've driven the challengers that can come manual and they said dude your first three gears are like useless if three pedals is an option there is no option however there is no option for a third pedal in this car so like my truck yes it's a stick jetta yes it's a stick uh when i get a jeep to build here soon as well um it's gonna be a stick. That's just how you know I am. But I'm gonna be honest, from inside the cab of this, it's an awesome, awesome ride. Exhaust is only loud under acceleration, which is honestly, honestly ideal. Yeah, there's a lot of people who won't drive vehicles like this in the rain, but you know what, I'm, I'm gonna use the car. Um, obviously after I detail it, I'm gonna be a little more cautious because I don't wanna you know, keep continually detailing it, but I'm gonna you know drive the car like it's meant to be driven. Obviously when I get some you know, drag radials and uh, grip your tires on this, it's going to be a little more difficult, but it's just an awesome machine to drive. guys and this isn't even everything here's just a section of the new lift you got your coil over mounts here you got your new four link um, brackets for the front uh, you got your giant track bar bracket for the rear it also has your um, which we'll call it also has your coil over mount integrated into it your resi holders which is awesome that this max altitude lift comes with a steering box brace for the rams here's uh, helper shock brackets along with uh, you know your sway bar end links and then in here we still have so many parts that I didn't have room to take out just yet longer brake lines we got our new control arm and the biggest piece in here which you guys can see these bolts are absolutely huge but we got parts all the way down to the bottom layer in this but underneath this is what I'm saying is this 
to this is my new cross member and as you can see this sits on the bottom of the box it goes up to about here so this new cross member goes from here to here and all the way across the bottom of the box i i took some of this foam out earlier but it is absolutely massive let me take this out in the sun for you guys this color is just stunning and as you can see look at this it's an awesome awesome compliment to any lime green but yeah guys this kit is huge there's so many parts to it I'm gonna have to uh, go through all this in these instructions over here we got two gigantic packets I'm gonna have to run through we got one gigantic packet for the front and one gigantic packet for the rear gonna go through it all gives you diagrams measurements you need to make parts to weld stuff like that this is a big big lift but yeah we're just waiting on the coilovers to ship in and then we can dig in and getting this kit on hopefully they ship soon fox is a little bit back ordered on them so hoping to get them in quite soon but this thing looks awesome all right guys we packed everything up tucked it away for when we get the coilovers in and when we can actually start on the kit so it's going to be there for a short while longer and then it's going on the truck so as you guys can see this is why i drove the hellcat this morning is because it's going to be a nice awesome day after work so we took it out and obviously got to pay the price so we are at the first wash we're just going to power wash it nothing nothing crazy we're going to get all the stuff off uh, all the dirty rain water and stuff Get all that stuff cleaned up, and then, uh, yeah, we'll get back on the road. So not used to washing such a small object I'm so used to washing the truck it's like a whole different world I literally got out I could spray the roof I could spray everything I can see over the car I can get around the car whole different game Wow awesome just freaking awesome okay so the one problem that I already have with this car is so many ponies no room to gallop it's like this car just lets you cruise at like 50 like it just idles pretty much at 50 like you're just going and every time you're trying to have any room to gallop you done come up on somebody that fast and like i said that was like quarter throttle trying to take it easy on this car before i you know i got 400 more miles to go I said even at a quarter throttle like that i mean it just it just goes oh just watch not hitting that puddle but Oh, now we have room, but, oh, no, they're not turning, whatever, but, oh, this is just, this is honestly, this is a machine, this is something else, guys, something else, now, I never drove a scat pack, I drove one Hellcat, and uh, I was sold, I drove that, uh, if you follow my Snapchat for the longest time, I drove that a while ago, but I was sold, and let me tell you, windows down, some, once there's actually, I mean, it's only 41 out, so granted, Tires not going to be that sticky, uh, you know, in weather like this. But once it's hot out well, and the pavement's a little warmer, well, have better traction as well. But oh, this thing's an animal, guys. That supercharger wine, like I said, look at that. That zero to 60, it wasn't even zero to 60. That was just like acceleration and you're at 60. It's just something like, obviously I've never had before. And obviously people who have like owned sports cars and stuff are probably like, oh, here we go. First timer, but legit, yeah. I've had this for like a day and a half and I know from the outside it's loud. Inside, not that loud. Ah, I kind of want to cut the mid mufflers off already. Soon, we'll get there soon. Just got it. Can't be modding it like crazy just yet. All right, we're at 100 miles officially, so I can't. Uh, once we hit 500, then we can start doing stuff like uh, performance and exhaust and stuff like that. Because if the exhaust is cut off, you guys surely know I'm going to hear that all day long. So you know, pedal to the floor. 
uh, straight to the gas station because that's all we're <laughs> that's all we're gonna be at. Yeah, shake that monkey, Hellcat. But um, oh man, love this thing. We're gonna get this thing tinted. I still gotta unwrap it, do a full first detail. Uh, I got a lot to do to this. I got a lot to do to the truck. As you saw, the lift kit just came in. Uh, they're checking on the shipment of the coilovers that are coming from Fox. So when those come in, will be because I can't really put the lift kit on and then the coilovers because we're converting the whole suspension to coilovers. When the coilovers come in, we can do the full lift. We can get the lift done. I have the instructions right here. I'm gonna read through them, uh, get familiar with the kit. Uh, that's something I do always when I get a new lift that I've never done before. Uh, I just get familiar with it, kind of see what the steps are, see what they're thinking, uh, stuff like that. So we're gonna go through that, get that done, knocked out, taken care of. And then we're also going to, yeah, especially with spring and summer coming right up, a lot of truck shows, a lot of car shows, a lot of everything. I gotta do tint, clear bra, ceramic coat, stuff like that down the road, obviously pipes. We gotta do um, maybe some stuff, maybe, maybe some goodies under the hood. There's also some cosmetic things I need to get to. Um, I know a lot of people said, dude, the car is an animal already. What could you possibly do? And I'm going to talk over this in, uh, in another video, but my plans for this car are, you know, is not, is not what you expect. Yeah. We got an install coming for the truck. Um, not the lift kit. We got something else, something awesome that will kind of pairs with the lift kit so we got that coming soon i actually already have it inside uh that's an awesome video for you guys because it's kind of lacking in the industry of something quality like a quality product for this situation i just want to say thank you guys for watching thank you all for the support on the new hellcat thank you all for the support on the truck build and i want to thank you in advance for all the support on the new stuff to come for the channel here soon as well um like i said guys back when i said it's gonna get crazy that indeed it is. So I just want to say thank you guys for watching. Take care. If you haven't been here before, please get down there, click subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, shoot this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in the next video.